Hey everybody, I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. Got an interesting one today, people. Extract. It's a love-hate relationship, right? You love the burn, hate the, the cramps, the taste. This is one million Scoville Ultra Pure Edition Premium Pepper Extract from Ashley Food Company. So a big shout out to my friend David Ashley and Bill Moore for making this happen. Uh, this is only going to be a little bit of a review here. Um, may do something crazy with it later, but a million, it's only a million. So, um, pepper extract, extreme heat level, it says. It's funny, you stack this next to the same company. The Ashley Foods makes the plutonium. So, you got your one here, and it's extreme heat level, but then you got your nine. Highest thing in the world. Um, all right, so warning it's an, a food additive only. This is not something that you're supposed to be eating the way I'm about to eat it. So, don't do it. Supposed to add it to chili and tacos, or whatever seasoning, and just a teeny little micro yeah. bit can dramatically affect your food. So, um, this is an all-natural, essential chili pepper oil created by using a 5,000-year-old technique. This is not a sauce or a condiment. There you have it. Go here. Here are the ingredients: naturally extracted pepper extract. And there you have it. That's it. Not a very confusing list. Naturally extracted pepper extract. All right. It's an interesting uh, relationship with Ashley Food Company. They've hurt me many times. Look at this warning label. This is one of my favorite things about Ashley Food Company. Look at that warning label. And if that's not good enough, there's another thing on the back side. This is incredible. I think a couple times years ago, um, I read the whole la warning label. Number six is great. I am not inebriated or otherwise not of a sound mind and fully capable. This is funny. Great warning. All right, so let's give this a wing here. We got the little whites. That's the safety top on there or whatever. The... Hey, before I do that, let me. Uh, cool painting. Came in and saw this today. I thought, I need to show this off. This is Holly. Holly, right? Yep. This is Holly. Uh, this is, I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is called Lake Tahoe. Uh, vintage Lake Tahoe, this is called. So kind of a cool painting. I like the colors. Colors work for me on this. They make me happy. All right, so we're going to uh, get into this uh, extract and see what it tastes like. Got to make sure I keep it in the frame of the camera at all times because I know some people are. Of course, this isn't a challenge. I'm just tasting it. All right. Yeah, this isn't the, you know. Sorry. It's the only jar I have here. This is nothing else in front of me. This is the only jar I've got. But, I man, I'm doing a very little bit of this because it smells just like plutonium. Don't taint your sauce. Definitely don't taint your extract. If you're still tainting your sauce, go to johnnyscoble.com and get a spoon. You need to. It's a game changer. All right, so if you want to kick on your smell of vision, you can smell that, you guys. You guys smell that? A little handshaking this morning. Uh, I haven't really eaten anything, but if you smell that, it's just, man. Okie dokie. That is all I'm doing today, people. That's plenty. It's got that really gnarly extract aroma. Now, this is really thin. This is a sauce. You can, look at, you can, you can see it. It's actually running. Do you see that? The plutonium nine is so th it's It comes as a paste. You got to literally heat that up. If you've seen one of the three times I've done that. You have to heat it up to get it to be in a liquid form. This is liquid. This is going to be hot as can be. So this is a million Scoville heat units, which in the grand scheme of things, like for what I've been doing as of late, it's not very hot at all. But for people that aren't really into hot stuff, this is a nightmare. So we're going to try this. It's one million uh, ultra pure edition. I am Johnny Scoville, and that is a little heat we're trying to chase here we go. 
So here's the deal with extract. You know why they say make it a food additive? Because <laughs> as it sits like that, not so pleasant. Now sure it's a pepper extract, but you're not really tasting. Um, it's not pepper like you think it is. It's very, 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 very hot, but it's got a metallic flavor. If you take it, if you try it like this, it does. Now, if you mix it in with foods as a food additive like it is supposed to, you got a winner. It's not going to, you know, won't ruin your the flavor profile. And it's going to ratchet the heat way, way up. Like my tolerance is really high right now, but still, that's a very, very hot tincture. The heat on it for a non chili ad, this is a trip to an emergency room. I'm not fooling either. This is a problem. Um, if you're somebody who likes hot stuff, it's still an attention getter. It's going to, you know, it'll be in its grip for a while. On my scale right now, this is probably only like a two or three for me. But it's just because my tolerance is really high from all the stuff I've been eating. Um, if you guys want something that you can change, like if you have a pot of chili, you guys understand it would take a, one drop of this to change the heat on a pot of chili. I don't mean like a bowl in, in front of you, but I mean a pot on the stove. So this stuff goes a long way. I would venture to guess that if one of you guys bought this and you're, if you're not somebody who hits it really, really hard, this would last you five years. Get the plutonium, you'll will it to your kids. It's ridiculous how hot that stuff is. All right, ashleyfoods.com. Go check them out. Thank you, David. Thank you, Bill. Um, something real quick I want to talk about. It's really, really important, you guys. I never ask you for anything. I really don't. But if you look back, though, almost four years, I haven't asked you guys for much. I'm going to be including in the description box a petition for small businesses. I don't talk about politics on this channel, and don't make me delete the threat, the comment, because I will. What I want you guys to do is um, to read a petition that I've got in there about a new stimulus package that's helped. It's designed to help small businesses. The reason I bring this up, you listening to this right now, you work for a small business. Your mom and dad, they probably do too. Um, what the government considers a small business and what we as human beings consider a small business are very, very different things. Um, I don't know about the worldwide, but the United States is run by small businesses, and that's a fact. It just is. So here's the problem. There's this new stimulus bill, billions and billions of dollars, and it's only helping 3%, 3% um, of small businesses in America. I'm a small business in America. David Foy, my partner, is a small business in America. And you watching this, you're a small business in America or you work for one. So um, we're in a jam right now. This is what I want to ask you to do. I'll put the link in the description box. Read the, the uh, petition. It doesn't obligate you for anything. I'd like you to share it. And let's get a lot of people to sign this. I don't know what dent it's going to do in the big, the grand scheme of things, but we need to wake up. Um, if you guys are going to go buy some sauce, don't go to a big box store or buy some Tabasco. Go online and help a small craft sauce maker because this is white knuckle time for a lot of these business owners. So let's see if we can do that, okay? Um, it's an important um, petition. It affects the world. It, it, it does because everything that happens in America, guess what? That ripples worldwide. So I'm going to put this link in the description box. Please take a look at it, forward it, sign it. You want to see us around, don't you? I sure want to be around. Anyway, I love you guys a lot. I really do. Uh, great heat on this, you guys. If you want to burn your face off, this is a good way to start. Ashley Food Company. Furnace face. That's what you get. All right. Um, if you've already tried this stuff and he's already hurt you and damaged you, please go to the comment section and say so. I know they'll read the comments. Um, appreciate you guys a lot. Oh, it'll be a long time before I ask you for anything else again. Right there, that is our pepper. If you click that pepper, you know what's going to happen. You're part of our family. And if you don't want to miss a video, you don't need to, double tap the notification button and you won't miss any videos right here. League of Fire, yeah. love League of Fire. They're putting a spotlight on the chili world and creating a forum for the people around the world that do the things that I do to kind of showcase their talents. Right there, two relevant videos. I love you. I'm Johnny Scoble. This was Chase the Eight.